So the first thing that I actually bought when I was at the airport is a phone case, surprise surprise, and I've been looking at the skinny dip phone cases for so long, I always see them every time I go into Topshop, and I follow them on Instagram and everything, and I just love their phone cases so much, they're so cute. So I got the unicorn one, I think it's called like chubby unicorn or something like that. God, I feel so nervous. I don't even know where to start on this video. You will have seen that little clip just then, which I actually coincidentally kind of like stumbled across when I was stalking back through my old videos, just as you do. If you guys have been with my channel since the very beginning, you might remember me doing some phone case collection videos when they were like a thing. Um, I love those videos. I kind of wish that people would bring them back. Since I started my channel, it has always been a dream of mine to launch some phone cases. Um, and you're about to find out, this is so much more than that, but to be able to collaborate with a brand like Skinny Dip, who I've been obsessed with since the start of my channel, is just so crazy to me and so cool, and I just need to say a massive thank you to them, and I need to say a massive thank you to you guys for just, you know, making these really cool things be a thing that's able to happen and I am so in love with every single thing in this collection and I hope you guys love it too. So yeah, I guess I didn't technically say it. <laughs> I'm launching a collaboration with Skinny Dip. So I know that myself and Skinny Dip have kind of like posted little bits on social media um, and you might have noticed, some of you have been very eagle-eyed that over the past couple of weeks I've been introducing some things into my videos. For example, some necklaces. <laughs> Um, some earrings and uh, this particular phone case. So I've got jewellery, I've got phone cases and we've also got some makeup bags. I feel like my brain is a bit all over the place right now and I'm probably going to miss out some information so if I do. Everything will be in the description box, like all the important information you need to know will be in the description box. So I think there's actually 13 different pieces in this collection. I'm gonna show you guys them all first and then I'll probably go into a bit more depth after I've shown them. So the first thing, which is probably potentially, mm, I was gonna say my favorite in the whole collection, but honestly, I love this collection so much, like every single piece in it. But this is one of the strong contenders for being my favorite. So obviously this is an iPhone case. I've got mine on, um, I've got the iPhone XS Max and hopefully you can kind of see on camera. This is a super protective case. So this is called the Celestial Shock case because it's like really shockproof around the corners and stuff. And then it's got like the textured bits on the sides. So if you want like a heavy duty, good grip phone case, this is a great one. And I am just in love with the design of this. So it's got the gold around the camera hole and then it's got the gold um, kind of moons and stars and constellations and stuff. So this is phone case number one, which I absolutely love. Uh, we've basically pretty much just made my dream phone case and all of my visions. I'm gonna show you guys maybe like the mood boards and stuff that I went into the initial meeting with um, because, oh my God, their designers got everything spot on. This is like my dream phone case. I'm absolutely in love with it. I think I'm gonna go through all the like celestial themed bits first. Then I'll go through all the kind of like other themed stuff which you're about to see and then I'll go through the jewelry. So also in part of this collection which matches the phone case, we have this wash bag, which, oh my God. So this is actually holographic. It reflects every single rainbow color, but it's also kind of see-through as well. This is a big wash bag, so you can fit a lot of stuff in here. And it's got the exact same um, print all over it, but this print is just in black so that it really shows up against the holographic. And these are my favorite wash bags from Skinny Dip because they open up fully like this. They've got like a really cool kind of closing mechanism and so you can properly expand them like that put loads of stuff in and then you close it back up again and then obviously it's got the zip to do it up so this is wash bag number one and then it's little sister i guess actually i should probably take the tag off of this one if i can i'm too weak this is like its smaller little sister and again this has got the gorgeous kind of like moon and stars and sun and little like planets on it and then it's got the gold zip with obviously like the black kind of piping let me just fill it with some makeup and show you guys what it looks like so i've just chucked a load of makeup in here you can actually fit a lot in here like i've just put in a bunch of makeup and you've still got room for more i love having a clear makeup bag just so that i can see what's in it but then also it's obviously not fully clear because you've got all the gorgeous print on it um so oh ah i'm just in love 
with every single thing. And yes, maybe I'm biased because it's my own collection, but if this wasn't my own collection, I would buy everything. Oh, and just a kind of size comparison between the two bags. This is the difference. So this one, this is the big boy. Oh, I wish I had three arms. I'm trying to show you them all together. This is like the little family all together. And I do just want to say as well, um, at the moment, the phone cases are just for iPhones. I just want to make that clear just because I had a chat with Skinny Dip about this and basically their best selling cases are iPhones. They have made Android cases in the past, but they say that they just haven't like gone down as well. However, hopefully if you don't have an iPhone, you will love some of the other bits of the collection because there is so many different bits and pieces. There's literally something for everyone. So the next little family looks a little something like this. So this is a kind of blue marble sort of crystallized, collection if that makes any sort of sense so this is the second phone case there are two phone cases in this collection and this one is just a really gorgeous blue color um it's got gold stars it's got bits of like gold flake in it which looks really really cool this one is one of the kind of like flexible sort of cases actually the other one is too let me just take it off my phone and show you because i feel like that's quite an important key factor so this one has more of like a hard back but it's still a tiny bit flexible but then the edges of this are flexible so it's really easy to kind of like get on and off your phone so this one is your kind of standard phone case design it's not one of the um like super shock ones however this one still kind of like bends around your phone let me put it on my phone and this one has got my little logo on it that says skinny dip x sof the other case doesn't have that just because it is see-through and if it was on the inside like you would see it if you get what I mean. So this one is a bit more of like a slim lined sort of design around the edges and stuff. Um, and I just, again, I think it's absolutely beautiful. And then the final two makeup bags look like this. So this one has got this exact same kind of blue marbly sort of print all the way around it. And then it's got the gold zip. And then this one is obviously, as you can see, clear again, just because I really like being able to see what's inside my makeup bags. But there's another option as well. Um, so yeah, this is what this one looks like. It's absolutely gorgeous. I'm in love with it. I love all the zips as well. They're so smooth. <laughs> Probably quite a weird thing to note, but that's quite important to me. <laughs> and then look, it's the label that says my name on it. Oh, I haven't taken the plastic off. There we go. Little gold skinny dip logo as well. So that is makeup bag number three out of the collection. And then the final one, again, let me just take this plastic bit off. This is actually a brush roll, which is so cool so it does what it says on the tin there's a little bit of um elastic here to keep it closed and then when you open this up you can put your makeup brushes in here there's also a zip compartment at the end here you can actually use this as a pencil case or if you're like an art student or something you could put your paint brushes in here and then put any like pencils rulers whatever you want to put in here i mean it is designed for being a brush holder for your makeup but you know multi-purpose so just as an example i've put a brush in here and then obviously this little flap kind of keeps them from getting dirty and stuff there's space for eight brushes in here but then you could put any other brushes in this section or any makeup or just whatever you want really um again lovely quality zip so this is the brush holder slash pencil case slash whatever you want to use it for again in the same print nearly dropped it on the floor and then again if that wasn't enough for you we've also got a ring um what are these called a phone ring. I had a complete mind blank for a sec. So if you're one of those really clumsy people like myself who is um, dropping things quite a lot, <laughs> don't know if you've noticed in my videos, and you don't wanna drop your phone, this is a phone ring. So what this does, it sticks on the back of your phone here and then this bit can fold back down. So if you don't want it to be too bulky, then you just like fold it up like this and then you can just like hook a couple of fingers through it or just like one of your fingers through it so that you can like support your phone and not drop it and not drop it on your face when you're like holding it above you when you're lying in bed on your phone <laughs> they're just super handy um so obviously whatever phone you have if you've got an iphone if you've got an android um if you've got an ipad i guess maybe not maybe it's a bit too heavy but yeah this is a phone ring that can pretty much go on any of those which is really really cute and then the rest of the pieces in this collection are jewelry which i never thought would be a thing in the initial meeting we discussed phone cases and potentially makeup bags but when the design team got back with me um i was just blown away by how like they had just got everything that i'd explained in the meeting that i wanted they had understood and they were like do you want to do jewelry as well and i was like oh my god Yes, <laughs> because I am a massive jewellery lover, um, kind of like simplistic jewellery. I love layering necklaces. Oh, there's been a bit of hair across here the whole time. And as you guys have noticed in videos, you're constantly asking me where my necklaces are from. So we've designed some, 
that are really affordable and that you guys can wear and I can wear and yeah I'm just so happy with everything so the necklaces that I'm actually wearing now are separate but I've just decided to layer them so let me just hold on to this one for a sec this first one is actually a it can be a choker or it can be a short necklace because it's got little um, hooks on the back so you can adjust the length of it so you can wear it more kind of like up here if you want it to sit higher up on your neck or you can wear it a bit looser like I am and have it a bit more like a standard necklace and this one has got suns on it it's got moons it's got stars and the suns and the moons have got little faces with which is so cute. Um, again, matches with the other kind of like celestial things in the collaboration. Um, so that is the running theme of the jewelry. All of the jewelry is gold in color, just cause that's my favorite. Um, obviously it's not real gold, cause otherwise there would be like a thousand pounds a necklace. And then this one right here is a pendant. Again, you can adjust the length of it. It's got three different lengths, so you can make it like a little bit shorter, a little bit longer. And this one has just got a little sun and a moon on it. And again, they've got faces and they're so cute. So we then have another necklace, sticking with the exact same theme. This one is actually a layered necklace, so it's one necklace, but it looks like it's two. And this one is a little bit um, more kind of like understated, so there's not as many charms on it. But this one, again, has just got the little moon. Oh, I'm holding it the wrong way around. <laughs> It's just got the little sun and the moon and the stars. And again, these ones have got the faces on. And then it's got some even smaller moons and stars on the kind of like choker part of the necklace. And again, this one is adjustable with three different kind of like holes. So you can wear it shorter or longer depending on, you know, how long you want your necklaces or how big, big your neck is. <laughs> we then have two pairs of earrings. But if you don't have your ears pierced, then you do have the option of the necklaces or the next thing I'm about to show you. This first pair I have been wearing non-stop since I got the final samples. Um, I'm just in love with these. These are some small little Diamante, is that the word? You know, obviously like not real diamonds, but these are some little like sparkly gold hoops. And these are actually really cool. Okay, first of all, they're really easy to get in if you're worried about getting hoops in. Um, they just have one of these kind of clasp things so that just clips in to that you don't have to do any like weird maneuvers they're really easy to get in and out but these have got the little like gems on the front and then they don't go all the way around to the back but to make them look even more kind of like glitzy from the front they've then got gems on the inside of the back so that they just look extra sparkly when you're wearing them which is really cool so these ones are the bit more kind of like understated ones and i think they just go with everything i've been wearing these every single day since i got them and then if you want something that's a little bit more kind of, well, I was going to say more evening, but these are completely evening as well. These ones are a little bit bigger and a little bit more of like a statement earring, I guess. And again, they match with everything. These ones have got little suns dangling off them. So again, they're just like gold hoops with the same kind of like hinge mechanism to get them in your ears. So these have the same suns that are on the rest of the jewellery and they've also got a tiny little star attached to the sun as well which I think is so cute. I think these are absolutely beautiful. And then the final thing in the collection, if you're not into necklaces, if you're not into earrings, if you're not into makeup bags or phone stuff, there are some hair slides which again I am absolutely in love with these. They come as a pair and they're both exactly the same. I see loads of people wear hair clips kind of like doubled up like this. I should probably put them in so they just slide in like this and then you could either double them up and have two on top of each other like that or you could have one on each side again like depending on your style depending what you want to do and same as the earrings these have just got little suns on them and then little stars as well and I just think they're beautiful like honestly I could not be happier with the whole collection I think everything has turned out absolutely beautiful and I really hope you guys love it as much as I do. I just want to get up my initial mood board for my very first meeting with Skinny Dip just to show you guys kind of like how everything came together so perfectly. So I had a load of images of kind of like astrology stuff and like moons and like galaxy things um, just because like I've always just thought that that print was so aesthetically pleasing um, and like for example this t-shirt which is actually unfortunately from like a little independent store in Exeter it's not like sold anywhere um, but this has got like the moon and like a constellation on it and I just think that whole kind of like theme of things is so beautiful and I just love like looking up at the stars I know that sounds really weird but just like I love looking at the night sky and I just think everything with that print is just so 
pretty looking and I think a lot of people would agree with me so I'm hoping you guys will love that too so I showed loads of pictures of kind of like galaxy stuff and these were just to get kind of like examples that I liked for like prints and stuff obviously I wasn't gonna make a skirt but it was just to kind of like get the general vibe and then this was like a jewelry kind of like headpiece with like constellations um, like different clothing items different like pieces of art which I liked and then we moved on to kind of like some example phone cases that I like some of gold flakes some with kind of um you know like gold detailing and um what's it called when the back of it is transparent and then it's got the detail over the top okay the leaves idea we didn't decide to go through with because we thought we'd been done too many times um i've got like blue marble patterns i explained my kind of like favorite colors were like blue and like gold and just kind of like everything that's kind of like marbly and then I think where the jewellery kind of idea came from is I showed them some necklaces which I really liked and one of my ideas was for a phone case to have kind of like draped necklace sort of looking things on them but I think they then took that and thought okay Soph really likes these kind of like gold dainty necklaces so then they were like do you just want to make some necklaces so that's when I was like oh my god yes um and you know kind of like gold detailing on phone cases these are some previous uh, skinny dip phone cases that they've done um some more kind of like galaxy themed ones and yeah this was my little mood board and then when they gave me back the initial designs for everything I was literally just blown away <laughs> like everything was just exactly how I'd kind of like explained to them that I wanted. The designers had then gone away and like mocked up some stuff and it was literally pretty much exactly how I wanted it. Like there was only a few like minor changes that we made with things. Um, but it was mostly to do with like colors and just a few different like ideas with like different jewelry pieces and stuff. Um, so yeah, so that was my kind of like idea behind it. And I also talked to them about how I used to do my nails on my Instagram and that's where everything started. And a lot of the nail designs that I used to do, I would do kind of like galaxy nails quite often and kind of like pastel blue sort of nails. Um, and those were just like my favorite things to do. So that's where it kind of like developed from. I could talk about this for hours, but I feel like I should just give you guys the information. And please, if you have any questions, let me know down below. Maybe I should do like a, another Q&A video at some point or maybe on my vlog channel I should ask for you some questions to answer about this collection because I feel like I could just go on and on and on. So here's the important information. This collection will be launching Thursday the 3rd of October at 10 a.m. on the Skinny Dip website, which is just www.skinnydiplondon.com. Everything you need to know will be linked down below in the description box. Make sure you're following me on social media because I'll be like talking about a lot about it on there. On Instagram, I'm just at Soph. On Twitter, I'm at Soph Does Nails. Um, so if you have any questions about the launch or you know just wanna find out any more information, I'll be posting about them on there as well. And everything in the collection, each individual item is under 20 pounds. The most expensive thing is 18 pounds, which I think is amazing. I just really hope you guys love everything as much as I do. I'm so proud of this collection and so proud to be working with Skinny Dip on this and um, yeah thank you to them so much for believing in me <laughs> um, and wanting to do this with me and then obviously thank you to you guys for being able to make this happen by like watching my videos and just like interacting with me and um, yeah I would really not be able to do anything really this cool if it wasn't for you guys so thank you so much I feel really nervous I really hope you guys love it please let me know what you think down below and yes I will see you in my next video bye